The shift in what we call this went from it being worth about 10 cents an ounce to being worth up to $10 an ounce. It's kind of nuts whenever you look at these hydration packets and who's been buying them. So originally we know about Gatorade, we know about Pedialyte, but the new age kind of like hydration packets, these are liquid IV that got bought by Unilever, a $60 billion company, Noon that got bought by Nestle, a $94 billion company. And then the ones that haven't been bought yet, we're talking about Drip Drop, Scratch Lab, these are ones that haven't been bought yet, but you know that they're probably going to sell for possibly eight or nine figures. It's really cool and it's kind of crazy to see. Really, the only thing differentiating these companies is the marketing that they do. If you were to go onto Alibaba and just do like a quick scan of private label packets, you would find almost exactly the kind of look and feel that you see in these element packets. And they're selling them for 25 cents, 20 cents, 15 cents per piece of eight packets. So if you're looking at doing a private label kind of piece, then the only thing that's helping you differentiate yourself as the type of marketing that you do. Uh, let's actually take this one step further and try to figure out what type of marketing campaign would we do. Uh, the NCAA recently changed the rules, in which case you can actually sponsor your athletes directly. I think it would be kind of fun to do an underdog story, underdog marketing campaign, where we find the people that might not be sponsorable normally. These aren't like the first string. This might be the second string, the third string. These might be the bench warmers. You find the person that's at the UT lacrosse team, or you find uh, someone that's on the curling team, and you make this big story story about like how they learned how to curl and their first game that they went to with their dad. And then you plug your electrolyte solution into that campaign. I think that could do really well and you could grow a pretty decently sized business off of it. So hope that helps. Cheers.